Hello, my dear friends, I'm Stanislav Shamayev, a licensed business immigration and corporate attorney in Miami, Florida. In today's video, we're going to be discussing the EB1A talent visa and the lawyer's role in preparation of the case. At the end of this video, you will be able to learn how to get a free evaluation of your EB1 case. Let's go. But before we begin, please smash that like button because you love my content and you're enjoying my videos and you do appreciate them. So give me the love back for a good content, that like button, the like is on you, the good content is on me. Why am I talking about this topic today? And I do believe this is a very important subject because recently a lot of imposters and fraudsters and consultants and paralegals activated and they are trying to steal your money and do nothing for your cases. This is more educational video to make sure that you understand why you need to work with an experienced immigration attorney in order to achieve the result in your case. And I'm not going to talk on this topic because of uh, some kind of theory of my thoughts. No, I've seen so many cases where non-attorney or even non-experienced attorney prepared the cases, the good cases that were supposed to get an approval and which did not get approved because of the lousy job that was done on those cases. I cannot tell you the role of another attorney in, uh, in this field. I can tell you about my role and the role of the team that I trained to lead cases like EB1A. Number one. I am going to build a strategy in your case. That means that before even starting your case, you will have a document, a document on the paper that's going to grade your case, that's going to tell you which program is the best for you, that's going to say which criteria you satisfy before even starting the case and which criteria you have the potential to satisfy within next six months. And this document is called a strategy, a complex immigration analysis, which is basically a strategy of your case. And you get this document after you went through two steps, free evaluation of your case and complex immigration planning. Even before starting, you know exactly what needs to be done and how you're going to be doing this. I'm the one who develops this document. And after we start working on your case, number two, you will have a team of experienced people, that, which consists of two paralegals, one supervisor, a director of executive department, the assistant of the director of the, of the executive department, and the strategy department. You don't see the strategy department within your group, which is in a Telegram messenger. If you don't have it, just download it. If you have it, great. But there are more people working on your case and you will see the interaction with them in the future. Also, you will have the deadlines. I'm going to set up the deadlines in your strategy in the case once we start working. Because I'm a big believer in deadlines, I don't believe and I don't put uh, much hope that you is going to organize your work because this is so much. There's so many things to do and I'm a big believer in breaking down the mass of the work and giving it to you by sections, okay? By portions. You know that within next two weeks, you need to produce this type of documents, which will, will then be reviewed by the whole team. At least review your paperwork. One paralegal, one supervisor, one 
strategy department specialist and myself. Okay, at least four people, sometimes even more. So make sure you know how to work by deadlines and you take responsibility for producing the paperwork that I requested from you. Number three, not only I'm gonna provide the strategy, the team and the deadlines, but also I will be controlling how you satisfy those deadlines. And if I see, let's say two months in, I open up your case, I open up the progress table, and I see that you're falling behind the deadlines that I set up for you, I will do the PIP, Personal Improvement Plan. I'm gonna revise all the workload that you have for your case, and I'm gonna tailor the rest of the case and the new timing and the new deadlines just for you. And if you see the PIP in your case, that means it's time to start working hard. We have to file your case within six months. And if we don't, there are sanctions, okay? There are sanctions and the sanctions are the additional payment, okay? I'm not interested in additional payment from you. I'm interested in effectively and rapidly filing your case. So that's why I'm doing everything so you are on track of your case. I'm not one of those attorneys who is gonna be, okay, this is the paperwork you need to do, come back when you're ready. And two years pass and you're doing something, you don't know what's going on, no. We have deadlines. We have people pushing you on those deadlines. You have the strategy, you have the personal plan, you have the templates, you have all the examples that you need. You get in touch with the team to help you to understand if you don't understand. So you get all the resources. So you need to act on that. Number four, the communication. Guys, I'm a big believer in a 24 7 communication of course we need to take into consideration the nights and the weekends but during the work week you need to have instant communication with your team because if you're working on your paperwork and you get a bunch of questions you can always send them to the telegram messenger to your own group and get the answers within 24 hours, but in most cases, almost immediately. Unless your question needs to be analyzed by the attorney or the strategy department. They may take like up to 24 hours, maybe sometimes even more, depending on the complexity of the question. But mind that most of the attorneys communi still communicating with you through emails, and they may take two weeks, up to a month, maybe more, to answer simple questions. I don't believe in that. I believe in a fast and effective communication, 24 hours max. If it's a serious question, maybe 48 hours, but most cases, fast communication. So this is something, that infrastructure that I provide for you and your cases. Not only we are creating the infrastructure in the communication and the examples and samples for your case, but also after I file the memorandum of your case, and this is one of my main roles, to take the evidentiary base that you gathered based on my strategy with my team for the first five months of working on your case. Then I take a month to draft the memorandum. A memorandum is the most, is the most important document in your case because this is something the immigration officer is reading and making his conclusions on. This is a very serious document and I draft that paper based on everything we've done in the case before that. Once we're done with that and the designer made it all nice and beautiful, we printed out the case, sent it to the USCIS overnight and we are waiting for expedited processing for 15 days, sometimes up to 45 days depending on the visa and after the approval and we are working for the approval and for the result. We are not just stopping there. We are providing a new team in your group who is gonna lead your case 
after the approval, depending on the situation, if you're adjusting your status in the US or changing your status, or you're going through the consulate proceedings, we are helping you up to the moment when you got your papers in the US or when you got your visa stamp in the passport. This is a full cycle of the work that we do for you. And this is just the tip of the iceberg because there's a lot more, you know, this is not the video where I'm gonna, that I'm trying to explain everything we do for you, but the main role of the attorney of a licensed, experienced and seasoned attorney in your case, in my corporation. Stanislav, it's all great, but how much you charge for all this beauty and all these processes and the teams and everything you offer in the cases. Guys, I have the open door policy for the pricing and the prices vary, but in general, the non-immigrant visas, you get the complete filing of the petition for $11 thousand dollars so like o1 e2 cases and the immigrant visas like eb1a eb2 in iw for thirteen thousand dollars and that is the complete filing of the petition and the way the payment structure is developed is you have to make three payments one in the beginning one closer to the middle of the case, like on the third month of work, and the last one at the end. So if you break it down by percentage, that's gonna be 35%, 35%, and 30%, okay? So three stages of the payment. And of course, if you wanna pay in full in the beginning, I'll take that, but I do believe it's more convenient for you to break it down in three parts. It's better for you financially and psychologically because I know a lot of you guys think that if you pay the money, the attorney is gonna just disregard and start being lazy. And that's not the case in our company, but still, I, so you feel confident that's the way we developed our fee structure. How do I start? the process of immigrating to the States and working with your company, Stanislav. And this is very easy, guys. First step is a free evaluation. Call it a consultation. That's what other attorneys charge you money for. I don't believe in that process. I think everybody should get at least a free evaluation to know if you have the case. And for me to know if you have the case, I don't want to charge any money for that, so that's your first step. The links are below this video for EB1A visa, and just click on it, and you'll see uh, you'll see a bunch of questions. Answer all of them within two days. I will get back to you and analyze your case and see what potential you have, and if you do have potential, I will invite you to the complex immigration planning. Is already something that you need to pay for but that's included in the contract. I charge $350 for this work and it happens in two phases. First, you meet with a data manager and she will spend about an hour with you sucking out all the information from you that I need. And then in a day or maybe two, you will meet with me for 30 minutes through Zoom or here in the office and I will already build a written strategy of how we're gonna file your case, and you will find out what exactly good for the case, what's not, what we need to work on, how exactly we need to work on your case, and you will receive the written documents after the complex immigration planning and a list of documents. And once that is done, then the next step is signing a contract with my company and starting working on your winning case for the next six months. All right, guys, smash the like button, subscribe to my YouTube, follow me on Instagram, on TikTok, on Facebook, all the links below this video. I'm Stanislav Shamayev, a lawyer of the future. Your future begins here. Good luck.